Hey guys, Acid Casual Gaming here. Today, we're going to get the crown chest, and we're going to try to fill up our chest slots. Without further ado, let's hop into a battle. I really like doing these 2v2 battles because there's no risk of losing trophies, and you also get a uh, chest. So, let's see. He's got the executioner. Looks like he grabbed that. He's gonna put that down and back that up with the baby dragon. And we're gonna fireball his elite barbs. Oh boy, that's destroyed. Oh dang it, why did I do that? Back up his wizard so you can't get any damage off. Okay, we got some decent damage on his tower. In their towers. Oh, that was perfect. Put your P.E.K.K.A. down. Perfect. That took care of that. Put my baby dragon down, because, yep, he's going to put down skeleton army. And there goes our P.E.K.K.A. though, still. Getting some chip damage on the tower. If I, would have clone, if I had a clone, I would have cloned that because he's not doing anything about it. My clone isn't in this battle deck, so. Fireball is minor, so it doesn't get any damage off. Oh, that was a perfect clone. Okay, so we're both down one tower. Let's see, I'm gonna take out his Sparky with this giant skeleton. Because it, when the giant skeleton dies, it will drop a bomb and that will take out the Sparky. So let's zap it. And fireball it all. Actually, no, 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 why'd you put your P.E.K.K.A. there? That was really stupid of him. That was really dumb, because he knew that I had the giant skeleton bomb. I don't know why he put that there. It looks like we're going into overtime if we can stop this push. Oh, no, this is bad. No, it's not. We got it. Put on the giant skeleton so we can't put down any sort of really small troop. Fireball his wizard. Zap the skeleton army. It looks like the Pekka's gonna get one hit off. Nope, he fireballed it. Of course. That was okay. This is not going well. My goal is just to hold them off till overtime's done. As you can tell, my teammate isn't the smartest guy. Put down a hog rider and a log, so we can't put down the skeleton army. Oh yes, that worked perfect. It's free keeps cloning him when there's a log. You have to let him get to the tower, take off one or two hits, and then clone him, because then you'll know that he's not putting anything down to counter it. Good game. Which it was, because it was a draw, so... Next battle. Barbarian Bowl. Teammate is Gamer. Saving up Elixir. Let's start it off with a Minion Horde and Baby Dragon Push.
Oh, double log. On that wizard, that's gonna be a lot of damage. Let's use the tornado to take care of him. Dang it, I wish I had my enough elixir to put down the giant skeleton, because then he could have tanked for all these units. Oh, oh no, 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 I hit his crown tower. Oops. Let's put the hog rider down so they target this. My teammate has gone silent. Not really doing much. Log away this barrel. Need to start a push on the right side so you can take down that tower to tie it up. Yep, down goes my giant skeleton. And we are going to take the W or the L. Not the W. I don't know what that minion horde was. <laughs> Direct the executioner. Log away the skeleton army. Some more hit points. Off the tower, come on. Oh no, this is. Yeah, he's gonna take this tower right now. The least we can try to do is get one clone. I think my teammate's giving up. Yeah. He stopped doing stuff at the end. So, one more battle. Put the executioner in the golem. That could be a pretty nice push. If I put the skeleton or the giant skeleton in front of the golem, see what he's got. He's putting down an elixir pump. Okay. I'm going to do a hog rider zap push, wait for him to put something down. Nope, he is the knight. Or the prince, my bad. Slog it. Put down the tornado to stop the prince. Oh, yep, we've got the Executioner Giant Skeleton push. This is gonna be good. Zapping the mini P.E.K.K.A. so he doesn't get that many... that much damage off. Oh boy, there goes our whole push. Terrific. Well, we got a decent amount of damage on his tower. Down to 1,234 hit points. He's putting down the Lava Hound. I'm gonna save my Minion Horde for that. That does really well at taking out big units that are good at tanking, so... And it, also it will also take care of the Lava Pups. Oh, I bet he's gonna clone that. So we'll have four. That Minion Horde... Oh, we almost got it taken down. Let's tornado all this up. And the wizard's splash damage combined with the tornado is really good. Oh yes, we have a golem push. No, the wizard went in front. Let's 
put down the giant skeleton in the back. So tanks for the executioner. Let's fireball this princess. Let's do a quick log hog rider push. And oh nope. Yes, got his tower. Now we just need to defend, defend, defend. Defend, zap, zap. No, he has the arrows. And that's the game. Well, today was not a lucky day for me. Well, that's all for this video, guys. I hope you enjoyed, and if you did, please like, comment, and share. Thanks, I'll see you in the next video.